In this lesson, I want to show you how to add an image content. And what this does is it puts the image on one side of uh, the page and the content on another side. So you get to pick and choose which side that you want the image position to be. So first, we have to add an image. I'm going to grab this one right here. And then you can choose the position. We'll put this on the left side. My content image here. And then you can choose the, um, the tag for this one, H1, 2, up to 6. So I'm going to just put this as H2. And then you can choose the font size, uh, the font weight. So if I want to have this like a really big font uh, from the normal H2, I'm just going to put in something like 50. You can change the colors as well. So I'm going to change the color for this one. Change the color. And then this is where you put in your content. And I'm just going to copy this and just paste it. Just so you see what it looks like with the content. You can also include a link here. to If you want this to link somewhere and then the button, just put something like click here now. And you can choose the size, standard, large, small, or extra small. So I'm going to loop the standard. And then you choose the button type. Put in success. You can also add an icon with it. It's going to grab that one. And you can choose to add this full width uh, or not. So let's just leave it at the uh, normal width. And so you can see what this looks like. And save it. Let's preview it. So this is what it looks like. You have this on the left side. And you have the content on the right side. Uh, so let me add another one again. So I'm just going to duplicate this. Just clone it. Uh, but this time, I'm going to put the image on the right side of the page. And this is really great too for styling, you know, your pages. Uh, I'm just going to change this. Remove that from 50. Just leave that at the normal. And then for the font weight, you can put, uh, if, if you want to bold or lighter, you can put that there. Uh, but I'm just going to leave that as it is. And for the stand, I'm going to change this the button size to large and then change this one from success to info. And then let's change the full width. Let's put yes so you can see what that looks like. And then let's click on save. And when you refresh the page, now you have content on the right side and you have content on the left side of the page. So sometimes when you're styling your page or you're adding content, this is the look that you're going for then this is a great way for you to do that if you notice here where it says click here now the button size has changed uh compared to this one and also the font size the heading tag here this the h2 this one is the h2 but the difference is this one would change we over uh did an override so that it is, is now much larger than the actual size of the h um h2 i believe 